Hey guys, I'm Ty with Muscle Wiki, and this is simplifying the incline chest fly. So I'm gonna give you some tips here to get the most bang for your buck out of this exercise. And here we go. Now first thing, you want a slight bend in your elbow. You wanna try to maintain that bend in your elbow for the entire rep. You don't want too large of a bend. You also don't want to extend fully and hyperextend your elbows. So you kind of want to walk a fine line between the two. Pull your shoulder blades back and arch your spine. Point your ribs up toward the ceiling the same way you would on a normal bench press. And then at the top, you want to point the dumbbells back toward the ceiling. It's not necessary to touch the dumbbells together at the top. Uh, there's no more tension on the pecs at that point, so it's not really necessary. At the lower body, try to push your toes through the front of your shoes. It'll generate a little tension in your quads. The more tension you can generate, the better. And key thing here is passive insufficiency. If the upper arm goes behind the body, the pecs get too stretched in order for them to properly generate tension. And therefore, all the resistance goes onto your shoulder joint instead of the muscle. You don't want that. And that's it. Simple and plain to the point. Thank you guys for listening. And I'll catch you next time with the next one. Peace.